So, when it comes to the UK, we're pretty generous. I mean, let's face it, we're that good that we've got half the planet trying to come here. So, in order to keep up with the trend of this generosity, the UK has given Albania even more cash. Because it says that Britain has armed Albania with £1.6 million worth of cameras and drones. And they're going to use them to try and catch these gangs. That's 1.6 million. Now look, it's not exactly a bad use of the cash. Like, it's not the worst way to spend it. I mean, to be fair, it is a shame that we have to spend it in the first place. And it's a shame that it has to go overseas. It's also a shame that it's going on tech that we can't actually use. And it's also a shame that it's going to end up in the hands of dodgy overseas politicians. And it's also a shame that the government haven't bought drones for me and you. I mean, wouldn't that be nice? And it's also a shame that these drones that we won't get to use, it's a real shame that they're not going to be used to monitor the British coast. But, you know, other than that, it is a good use of the cash. Because as you can see on screen now, this is Albania. Well, it's, it's Flight Simulator Albania, but it's probably the closest that I'd want to get. But it is accurate to things like the streets and the roads and the fields. So that's what they're trying to monitor. Like on one hand, our border is made out of water. And that does have its own challenges. But they've got to try and defend a land border. And there's going to be some pros and cons to both. Like they're going to have completely different tactics. And honestly, I don't know which is harder to defend. I guess to be fair, it's probably easier to defend like a, like a water-based border. It's probably easier to defend it. Because, like, the water does actually act as part of the border itself. Like, water is a pretty decent, effective wall. But do you think that this is £1.6 million well spent? Or like myself, do you wish that the government just bought you a drone instead? And what has happened to Sadiq Khan to get him looking like this? Honestly, he's, he's pretty upset. So, thank you for becoming one of the 35,425 subscribers. Thank you to the channel members, and thank you for checking out this video on screen. This country has gone crazy.